Good morning, everyone. Myself, Murli Dharadi. In this video, we are going to discuss about sonar cube overview. Okay. What is sonar cube? Let's see. First one, what is sonar cube? Sonar cube is a code quality tool. It is a static code analysis tool. Okay. Using this code sonar cube, okay, we can detect the bugs, vulnerabilities, code smell. Okay. Sonar cube is a open source and also we have a developer edition and enterprise support as well. Some of the projects, they may use uh, open source. Okay, some of the project, they will be used developer edition. Some of the project, they will be used enterprise. Based on your selected the particular uh, one, the features will be enabled. Okay, in open source, limited features will be enabled. Based on you are taking developer edition or enterprise support, enterprise edition, you can get more features inside that particular sonar cube. Okay, and Sonar Cube it support 25 plus languages, including Java, Python. Okay, and the default port number is 9300. If you want change, you can change that particular port number as well. Okay, and the current LTS version, LTS is nothing but long term support. Remember, when you are installing any tool in real time, we will be used LTS version. The reason is if you install LTS version, Okay, you may not get any issues. If you use the latest version, what will happen? You may get some issues because they are developing, keep on developing, they are releasing new versions, right? It may some uh, bugs. Okay, instead of that one, majorly will be used LTS version. LTS is nothing but long term support. Current LTS version is 8.9.10. 8.9.10. And this particular, if you want to install 8.9.10, you must require Open JDK 11. Open JDK 11. Okay. If you want to install 8.9.10, we should require 8. Sorry, open JDK 11. And if you want to install any sonar key, you should require at least 4 GB RAM. Same as in uh, 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 Nexus, we, we require 4 GB, right? Same thing for sonar key, also 4 GB required because it will consume more memory in this particular sonar key. Okay, got it right? Any questions? And coming to the pricing plan, go to the Google Sonar Cube. Planning, plans and pricing. Okay, remember Sonar Keep default uh, website is official website is sonarkeep.com. Okay, sonarsource.com. Click this one. As I said, like we have a open source and also we have a developer edition and, and also we have an enterprise okay, data center. Based on your use cases, will be used either developer enterprise support in real time. Okay, if you use the developer you you will get a lot of uh, features enabled okay if you use enterprise you can get a lot of features based on selected the particular planning you can get the more details okay i mean more features it will be enabled in the particular sonar cube got it right and also here go to sonar cube nts version okay just type it here if you see here long term support just click this one now you can able to see the what is the long term support version 8.9. Okay, click this one. Now we can see here community edition, developer edition, enterprise, and data center. But we are using community edition, which is open source free. Okay, come down here. Now we can see here the LTS version is 8.9.10. We, we will be uh, download this version and we can install in our uh, Linux server to work on the particular sonar cube. Okay, are you right? Any questions? And also, as I said, like uh, it will be support uh, Sonar Keep support 25 plus languages. Just type it here Sonar Keep supported languages. Now we can see here. Uh, yeah, we cover languages. Click this one if you object here Java, C, C, plus C, okay, JavaScript, TypeScript, it will Python, everything almost 25 plus languages, it will be support. Okay, you can choose any language, it almost it will be support. Okay. And one more thing, remember in real time, anyone using okay static code analysis tool under person, they will be use sonar keyboard. The reason is the sonar key will be generate the report very easily. I mean, very easily means it will be provide the details, uh, bugs, vulnerabilities, code smells, everything. Okay, got it right. If you have any questions, feel free to comment. Thanks for watching this video. We will see you next video.